Some few days ago, during Joyny's Prime Showbiz, we talked about the fact that there's a newest sensation on the block, Safo Newman, with the latest song in town that everybody is vibing to, Akokwa. With me right here, I have him here to shed more light on that. Hello, Safo Newman, how are you? I'm doing good. What about you? I'm okay. All right, it's a pleasure to meet you, by the way. Nice to meet you, too. Okay. Now, let's just get right into it. What people would want to know, the whole brain behind Akokwa, because... I first listened to it, then later on I, I realized that it was thriving. I think I first saw Paul's Ghana post it. Then I realized people were then jamming to it. What actually inspired that song? Okay, it's the conditions of the homes, the various homes in our country. How those, the children who go to live with others yeah. are treated. Yeah. Okay, differently from... Um, they are real children. children. Yeah, that is that is the inspiration behind the song. Okay, but someone would want to know: Have you personally been through such a situation be before? Because I know before a musician puts the music down, definitely or pens down any lyrics, you definitely might have um, had an experience, or maybe someone told you a story or something like that. Okay, um, what is happening is I've seen others being treated uh, yes in such a manner. And that is the inspiration. Also, as, a, as an artist, music has something to say. And you have to listen to it. Yeah. We have a different ear. Okay? You have to listen to as it. As an artist, have a different ear. Yes. Than we, the non artists. Yes. Okay. You have a different ear. You have to listen to what the music is also trying to tell you. And then you mm -hmm. add it. So y you should transcend beyond your own experiences okay. uh -huh, yeah so it's not like about you necessarily it's no, something right. that is going on yes and i think the right time is now to give it out okay. um, that's why it's making impact yeah all right but how did you feel earlier we spoke off camera uh you overwhelmed with a lot of things that are happening right now okay. how did you feel when you realized that your song was gaining traction well it is what I've been waiting for. So I feel thankful and then grateful for Ghanaians um, promoting the song. Mm -hmm. So I just felt thankful yeah. that all the hard work, I mean, at least, is paying. Mm. Yeah. Mm. But you know, upon your video, when I chanced upon your videos first, you were the only one who was doing like promotions. When it comes to your songs, then you just woke up one day, then it just went boom. Did you think it was like this kind of, would I say, blessing? Did, did you expect it to be this closer to you? Okay, good music sells itself. And some people who notice that this is, no, this is a very good sound, they started sharing it sharing it and then it caught fire so i believe it is not only my effort but those who are able to relate with the song mm. yeah they relate with the song very well and feel that no this must, must go out there that is what is making everything happen right now okay mm. all right now tell us who is Safu newman Safu newman let me use my twitter handle to explain it my Twitter handle is N Solomon Fair. Yeah. N Solomon Fair and N is Newman. Solomon Fair. Songs of love and motivation from an introvert. Okay. Yeah, so that is what I'm about when it comes to the music scene. Okay. Yeah. But personally who are you? Because we just saw a young lad. Mm -hmm. Safa Newman. People want to know who is Safa Newman apart from Safa Newman singing um, love songs, making sure your song transcends and all that. Who are you? I think I would like to um, know. Getting personal, with, like when we talk about you, mm -hmm. wh what do you, apart from the music, mm -hmm. what else are you into? What else are you passionate about? Okay. I'm also a teacher. And I'm, I want to impart Nali to um, those below me. Yeah. Yeah. So. Since, since 
you, you, your music started gaining traction have you been able to go back to the classroom to teach and how has the um the reaction been from your students especially seeing their teacher going viral like that okay i was there today yeah and yes they are happy for me that my music is going far they've been with me on even other challenges um zero fly the one that is at 99 on Ghana Top 100 Apple Music. They were doing the dance channel with me, and then now they've seen Saku, they're doing it. Uh, so they're excited. They, they see you as a superstar now? Uh, not necessarily. This word that you've been saying, if I'm a superstar, then what about those ahead of me? What are they? Yeah. So I'm a musician, just started. Yes, not just superstar. Mm-hmm, yeah. Okay, now talking about collaborations, which artists do you inter- because I believe your song Akokwa is perfect. Which artist do you think would best fit if you want to collaborate with someone to have a remix of your song? We have to let the music read the people first. Yeah. You have to listen to it over and over and over and then it will click. Right. Yeah, but assuming, assuming, assuming moving forward, it's it's just there because I know musicians sometimes you want to like just add or even not just Akokwa, any other musicians that you'd want to collaborate with in your with on any of your projects. That's what I'm saying. Um every artist has a particular kind of sound they make. Yeah. They make and Upon listening to the song, they will be able to determine that, no, this is my lane, if I jump on, on this. So you cannot really determine for them that, oh, this is can promise thing, this is sax thing. No, no, no. They have to determine. So, yeah, some people go to musicians with their songs, and then it's been there, it's been on the shelves, because they can't relate. Mm-hmm. They thought, yes, oh, Sakura should jump on this. I, I hear Sakura on this, but... He doesn't hear himself on on the song. Yeah, he can huh. he can relate to the song. Yes, so that's how it is. Uh, you have to not decide for the artist. You let them decide. Uh-huh. Okay, so now you are waiting for an artist to decide. Like, okay, so my song, my sound would sound best on your song. Yeah, yeah. Okay, all right. Now you have another song which is also thriving and doing well on Apple Music and other streaming platforms. Can you tell us more about that? Yeah, Suru Fly. That is the one. It was purposely made for TikTok. All the lyrics is action, 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 action. Verse one, chorus. Verse two, chorus. And that's what Sakuri jumped on, on TikTok. And I want others to to also jump on and help the movement. To yeah. What's the title again? Suru Fly. Okay, Suru Fly. Yeah. Okay. Suru Fly, and it's at ninety nine. Okay. Mm. Currently at 99 on Apple Music. Uh, yeah, Apple Music. Okay. But are you the one who writes your songs or? Yeah, I write my own songs. Write, sing, you do everything yourself. Yeah. Interesting. When 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 it comes to you you have how many songs out now? Around 20. 20 you just head of Akokoa. Yeah, so we fly to I have my early works, comp- I've compiled them into an album, um, early music. It's also available on all streaming platforms. Okay, all right. It's been an amazing conversation. But before we go, we, I just need an acapella. For, I can't let you go without getting an acapella for people's favorite song now, Akokwa. So, okay. are you ready? Okay. All right. Soon, soon, you will move to your menu on your Joe Boy, sir. Oh, JJ, no, so, 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 a dear me who no any me who will call so me a me so me a me so no don't try ni ya mama the view a no pa oba kwa so dem no a to jum holy holy a mama fa bo form ho a chiri ya masala chi o gunsa na na no bo sun fu fu to a manini o vi ya be ba fi na wa be ya me setosa. Wow, that's amazing. That's a raw, <laughs> that's a raw voice right there. Yeah. I think I, I wish I knew all the lyrics to sing alongside with you, though. Mm. But anyways, um, any last words? 
we are going to release the dance challenge on TikTok this evening. Okay. And all our Cocoa fans should meet me there and start duetting, start using the sound for the lyrics. And I'll also be duetting the best ones. So make sure you do it well. That part. Make sure you do it well. <laughs> all right, Stephanie, man, it's been an amazing time with you, and thank you all for watching. I'm Jacqueline and Smile Boy. Me, so you don't try me, I'm on my debut. I know, but I'm not going to do it. 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 I'm not going to